where I am right now, Kirby Park. I think I'm gonna take a nap on this grass down that hill right there. Maybe over there in those trees. Yeah, nice little spot, nice little pond way over there. Yeah. <clears throat> Anywho. Why don't you look at that? <laughs> I haven't done a vlog in a long time. So I figured I'd uh, do something like that with the sun right in my face. Ouch. This is really nice here. See that? Anyway, yeah. So I'm going to be putting up some stuff about... Uh, I'm going to put a really old vlog up. I'm going to put some footage up when I was really young. When I was like a kid. Not a kid, but like a, just a teenager or something. It's hard to get to the right angle here. I can't even see myself. I'm going to put some videos up of when I was a teenager. But I'm also going to be making a video about Soaked in Bleach. Uh, soaked in Bleach is going to be what the film that everybody really needs to see. Because, I mean, come on. I, I mean, it's common sense. It's like blatant and it's common sense that Kurt did not commit suicide. It's common sense. I mean, it's it's obvious. Once you even once you actually look at the details about that about this scene, about all that stuff, I mean, it, it becomes very odd. And uh, I'm glad I'm not like famous because if I if I was somewhat famous and I was gonna speak out about it, uh, who knows? Courtney might have me murdered or something. <laughs> hey, I'm not saying, but I'm just saying. You know. Anyway, it's just a real, uh, real messed up situation that that is. I'm gonna be taking a nap on this grass here pretty soon. Uh, but that's just a real messed up situation, and uh, I think that uh, the number of people believing that it was a murder are growing like rapidly because. It's not just because it's some rumor, it's not just because of that stuff, or it's not just because it's some fantasy world, and a lot of these people that were involved with Kurt and who knew Kurt, like, chose not to look at any of that stuff because they thought it was just media. But the problem is, is it's not just media. <laughs> it's actual facts and police reports and, you know. There's a cat. See him? There he is. There he is. There's a kitty cat. See him running. Hold on. Where is he? Where'd he go? Uh, uh, my eyes red. Maybe I got like some visine in my pocket. I you know what I don't understand is when the wind blows, the wind blows, the wind blows, and you cannot hear what I'm saying. <laughs> I made this whole vlog and I can't use most of it because the wind was just too much. But anyway, um, I hope uh, you guys check out my Zovin song. I hope you do. I think you're really gonna like it. I think you might like it. Might. So the cop cars are always looking after, looking looking for me. Uh, what I was saying though, uh, my Zovin project, I'm really excited about. Uh, I really want to keep that going. I really want to. Uh, I'd really like to have a full band for it, but the only problem is, is like, you know, I, my band, the way I have for the way and I don't I don't want to like confuse things by getting them involved with my solo project you know what I mean I mean they're gonna probably be on the album they'll be like kinda like you know how like the Wu-Tang Clan like if they do if the guys do a solo project they usually have some of the other members like come and help them out on like a song or two well that's how it's gonna be with Zovin I'll probably have my band members for the way come and do a song or two with me or something like that you know what I mean but I don't want to get it too confusing and then have like uh, play full shows with those guys or nothing, you know, because we already have the way and that's our thing, you know. But anyway, um, yeah, so I'm going to put links below for the uh, for the song, for the song I put up, Happy Snuggly Little Baby Kitties, the album, and uh, the song is called Owner that I put up, and I'm working on more of them. I'm probably going to have like nine songs in the album. Yeah, maybe about nine songs about that. I think that'd be uh, 
I think that's a pretty decent album, you know? I think so. Peace, love, and kitty cats. <laughs> I hope I don't look like a drug addict in, uh, in my eyes. I'm gonna sun, when the sun's in my eyes, I, my pupils are just completely, like, shut, and people think I'm on drugs. But I'm not on drugs. I don't do drugs. And I never will. It's a bad idea. Way, way, way back in the day, I used to, uh, you know, smoke weed and stuff, but it's honestly not that good for you. I just recently met somebody who told me that, yeah, they were 22, and they were smoking pot since they were 16, and he regrets it. He said that he wished he never did it, and he's he has a problem with it. He's actually addict. He's like, you, you can get psychologically addicted to it, and he's like, I'm in a bad mood if I don't have it. So, I mean, so really, I mean, is it really that good? Be good. I don't think that's good for you. And, uh, that's from somebody who does it every day. <laughs> so, anyway, uh, peace and love, everybody. I got my Starbucks. I didn't, I did not actually end up taking a nap because, um, it started getting cold out. It's like 30, it's gonna be 37 degrees tonight. And it's uh, getting towards the end of May. Isn't that strange? Alright, guys, I'm signing off. Uh, I am going to make uh, more videos about that whole uh, the Kurt Cobain documentaries right now. The reason why Montage of Heck came out is because they knew Soaked in Bleach is coming out. Uh, Soaked in Bleach. Is the movie that you that you should go see about Kurt because that uh, it's obvious that he did not kill himself. If you just look at some facts about the situation, it's very obvious he did not kill himself. And um, I'm uh, I'm very happy that Courtney Love hired uh, Tom Grant. I'm very happy that she hired Tom Grant to go look for Kurt because. If she hired any other guy, they might have taken money to shut up, and it might have been a completely different situation. Um, so, I'm very happy and uh, much respect to Tom Grant. Okay, see us. Live long and prosper.